Hi, I'm Joe Guinan. I'm sitting here with market strategist Andy Bush, and we're going to ask him a few questions about uh, what's going on in the economy and what's going on with Fed policy. You, you mentioned the tools of the Fed, uh, and uh, they're, they're concerned whether they have the proper tools to raise rate, rates. And uh, uh, let's talk about that for a moment. Uh, the idea of going into the marketplace, doing reverse repos, and pumping up the funds rate, I know there's been discussion around the Fed and in the marketplace about that topic. Uh, the, the level of excess reserves now compared to pre-crisis is dramatically uh, higher, uh, somewhere around $3 trillion in excess reserves now, maybe $250 billion back in 2007. Uh, how much sopping up of this excess liquidity do you think has to be done in order to get the funds rate to move? So if they raise the rate that they pay banks from 25 basis points to 50 on their reserves, mm -hmm. they also want to see the funds rate move from 11 to at least 36. Uh, to get that 25 basis point hike, they may have to sop up some of the liquidity. Do you have any sense of how much of that sopping up, how much reverse repos, uh, how big that lever might have to be and how problematic it will be? Certainly the Fed does not want to be in a position of trying to raise rates and finding out they cannot. Right. <laughs> right. I mean, this is really what's exciting right now because the Fed has no idea, yeah. right? So let's start there. Um, let's talk about the Fed funds market because that's where they used to be able to raise interest rates and, and have the impact. It has shrunk to a quarter of what it used to be prior to the crisis because of the, in, or the lack of use of it, right? There's no reason to use the Fed funds market if zero, interest rates are at zero, right? So, so that's problematic for the Fed. This is why they've developed these overnight reverse repo markets um, and, and tested them and tried to go through it. But they are actually going around the country, having meetings, talking to people, asking this specific question because they don't know. My guess is it's north of a trillion dollars they'll have to drain. So the thing that scares the bejesus out of the Federal Reserve is that they act to raise interest rates 25 basis points and nothing happens. That's where they will be signaling to the market that they've lost control and that the amount of excess reserves is so extraordinary that they can't control it. So that, to me, this is a wonderful question. I really don't have a good answer. I mean, a trillion dollars maybe have to come out, but there's so many excess reserves. And it's funny because the Fed, for under Bernanke and under Yellen, they all have said the same thing. Oh, yeah, we can mop that up by different tools and levers that we can pull. They have no idea. Well, thank you very much. This is Andy Bush, market strategist. I'm Joe Guinan from Advantage Futures. Please visit our website at AdvantageFutures.com. Thank you.